In Ann Arbor, a teenager is a finalist now in a national design competition where the only limitation is their imagination and maybe a dull pair of scissors. Our Grant Herms has the story of a young man hoping to make his dreams come true, one roll of duct tape at a time. For the past year, Vaughn Westerman was stuck. Stuck at home, stuck in front of a screen for school, stuck wondering what he would do after his senior year, looking for scholarships to help put him through college. There were a lot of them where it was like, you know, you just write a, write a paper on something. And none of those really stuck out until his mom came across something unique. And it felt like it would at least be more more fun than maybe, you know, just uh, writing about something. The 18 year old from Ann Arbor is one of 10 finalists from around the country in the Stuck at Prom Scholarship Challenge with a chance to win $20,000 in cash to put towards school. But he has some stiff competition. From the more conventional looks to the more outlandish, each created using only tape. Vaughn's theme, virtual prom. Every stitch and snip of his tux is made out of duct tape, right down to the boutonniere. The light green tape, you cut into strips, and we kind of, you know, added all these CPUs and, you know, RAM slots and all that computer stuff. And on the back, the Husky mascot of Michigan Tech, where he'll be going in the fall planning to study computer science, of course. It's hard to undersell just how much tape we're talking about here. The average roll of duct tape is about 45 yards long or 135 feet, and Vaughn used 18 of them. If you unstuck all of his tucks and put it end to end, that's 2,430 feet or taller than three Rensens stacked on top of each other. But there's one drawback to tailoring with tape that's often used to patch up leaks. It's hot. Just like, it's like wearing plastic wrap all around you and there's like no, no ventilation. But he'll stick it out for a chance to win. Voting ends July 14th and the winner will be announced on July 21st. If you want to vote for Vaughn, you can just go to our link on clickondetroit.com. Grant Herms. Local four. Oh, we got to go vote for Vaughn. He's very creative. So creative. Isn't, Isn't that, that great? Neat? Incredible. That really is.